Hello everybody and welcome back to Wildflowers, where, ooh, there is something in our mailbox today. Tara, if you have a moment, will you stop by my shop today? Thanks, Parker. Oh, okay. Well, I certainly will, after I take a speed spell. We cannot be going too slowly. The time for walking slow has passed. Lighten my feet and make me fast. Much better. Right. Okay, so... What else have we got to do today? I'm sure there were things that I needed to do. Uh, making my animal blessing. And uh, speaking to Parker. Okay, so how about we go and have a... Uh, just remind myself quickly what's needed for the animal blessing. Because I think there's things I needed to do for that that I didn't have. Um, so what we needed was three bumper harvest potions. And I think I was missing... Yeah. I was missing... Oh yeah, I was missing the anemone on that, so I had to go to the gloaming and plant flowers for that. Uh, we were in the middle of doing that. Uh, I need to go water them. Okay, cool. Good to know. Stick on some copper concentrate and maybe some gold. And then we'll go back to making conditioner. For my beautiful hair collection. I make any hair dye right now? I can, okay. Uh, we should. Let's do some blue, some blonde, some black. So at the moment, I'm just making various different colours to sell. And then we're going to unlock all the styles. And then I'll come back and make all the colours to uh, buy all the styles. That's the way we're working it with, with that. Um, I think clothing-wise... Uh... Yeah, clothing-wise, I don't have anything at the moment, so we need to make anything that we wanted. So, how about we run past Parker's place, see what he's got to say, and then go to the gloaming and water my flowers. Also, will the will the thing be today? There's a few days. It's five more days. It might be next episode. It might be this one. It might be next one. Depends on how much progress I make, how much there is to do etc etc hello mr parker what would you like hey tara thanks for stopping by welcome no problem what you working on my wedding gift for sophia and thomas a chuppah they're gonna stand under it for their fair haven ceremony oh wow that sounds like a really meaningful gift parker i could use some help sourcing the wood and some silk fabric to drape on top of it always with the silk leave it to me thanks you know I never thought I'd say it, but Thomas and I have really become friends. I want to help make their day special. Uh, two pieces of silk, 20 wood. That should be absolutely fine, no problem. Let's go and water these gloaming flowers. Still looking for, um, well, still giving Yuri presents. Uh, I've got a couple of praline cookies around. And we're also still giving uh, Gloria we're still waiting for a cutscene from her, I think. Those are the two people that we have to get to know right now. Everyone else is on their full hearts, or as far as I want to take their hearts anyway. Some of the dateables still have hearts to go, but I don't want to date them, so... Four is as much as we want to do. Right, so, uh, first level of the gloaming across the bridge. And we're just gonna just check if these enemy flowers need a little water. Uh, and then I think tomorrow they should be done. I put a big old booster on them, so. Two days remaining, so I'll have to water them tomorrow, and then they'll be ready the day after. Okay, that's fine. And then I might... I might want to just make sure I've got some Essence of Joy free so that I can make some brew potions. I don't know, I might be okay. But I want to get that herding spell done for Marty before the summer festival, which is in six days' time. So we would ideally want to do that. Um, let's see. Okay, so it's going to be two days to make the flowers. Maybe another day. I know we've got five days. Yeah, it should be ready about two days before. So that's fine. Let's go and do Parker's quest quickly. And I should also... You know what? Let's just broom it back. Broom it back up to the mountain, actually. And I'm going to do a little dig up there. 
up until quite recently, I have found every so often, every few days, I found a new recipe. So I feel like I should keep trying until I know 100% that there's nothing left. I think, like I say, I'm down to about, I think it's six recipes. Something like a really low amount left. So I think it might be quite hard to find them. And I don't know whether they're going to be ones that I have to dig up and fish up or whether they're going to be ones that come up as part of a quest. So I could be could be looking for nothing at this point. Because the game doesn't differentiate, it doesn't let you know whether they're going to be coming up as part of a quest or something. Um, didn't find that third spot. But like every time I think I'm done, I'm like, I've had like three days without finding anything and then I go and find something more. Uh, but if I have a look here, so got all the raw foods. We've got one pot dish left, which will probably begin with something like a T or beyond in the alphabet. Fried uh, F to L. F G H I J K. Some, some, one of those. So there's one there. We've got two the, of those, uh, two drinks and two desserts. And that's it. So there's six things left. And I've just got a strong feeling that, that we might be, might be at our limits. But I will keep giving it a try. Because what if there's only, if there's still a couple of things to find, a couple of drinks or something that I could find? I don't know. Is there anyone that has, like, a drink that they like that I don't have yet? That'd be a good, that'd be a good way to work it out. Just got that one. I know milkshakes. Milkshakes. Chai, I've got chai. I think I know how to make an apple martini. Pretty sure I do. Uh, a blue Hawaii cocktail. I might not have that one yet. I know how to make coffee and orange juice. Strawberry daiquiri. I'm not sure about that. Spinach smoothie. Okay, now let's have a look. So, drinks wise, we know the spinach smoothie, we know the blue Hawaii cocktail. We have a strawberry daiquiri. Hmm, okay. I mean, that to me looks like it could be some kind of. No, I don't think it's a milkshake. Don't know on those two at all what they might be. But yeah, with six things left, I think it's going to be hard. But anyway, we will keep giving it a go. So in the meantime, I need to make a couple of pieces of silk. And I could have a look at what else I want to make. Uh, in terms of... Oh, I've got lots of cloth now. Wonderful. I'll just make them in batches of ten now. That's good. Uh, and I want to make two silk at least. Oh, that's cloth. That is not silk. I would have been upset if I had run all the way over to Parker to give that in and it was cloth that I had made. That would not be ideal. In the slightest. Oh, hi Finn and Emmy. They're off. No, they're off to school not to do their lemonade stand. They're back from lunch, I think. Will this wood work for Sophia and Thomas's hoppa? Ooh, look at the grain. This is going to look perfect standing up in Thomas's farm. Are they getting married in the farm? Or, or is that just to welcome them home? Wait, they're not having the wedding in the woods? <laughs> no, not a chance. I can see it. Thanks for this, Tara. I'm going to get right to work on it. Cool, farm wedding. Two more things here we do not know about so we will follow the story along until until we do know about them so was there anything else I needed to work on I'm just gonna have another look at that herding recipe a sec because 
and then we'll go fishing down on the ocean I think uh, I just want to make sure that there's nothing else other than the flowers that we're waiting on or that we might be short on so let me just absolutely triple check it right so animal for, uh, we have enough vellum for all of them we have plenty of mandrakes and we have plenty of black ink and we could easily make more if we need to so it's just the bump harvest potions we just check what the actual ingredients for that are that we're not missing anything so I'll be able to easily make enough we've got enough nigella bone meal and silver for it so as soon as the anemones are done we can start on that uh, if I wanted to make uh, things run a little faster um, I would need to make a bit more essence of joy and collect some more wool weed. Okay. Well, in that case, that's what we'll do. I'll make two more essence of joy, and then next time I go to the gloaming to water the plants, we'll collect a bit of wool weed. Or if I'm across there checking on the coven or something. We'll check on coven tonight, I think. See what they're up to. Any last minute things, although I think the offering um, is the main thing for the coven at the moment. And just if anything comes of Sebastian's weird, weird little foray into, yeah, throwing gems into the wellspring. Maybe he'll find something from that, I don't know. Ooh, coconuts. Good for conditioner. <laughs> I haven't yet had to summon a storm just to get coconuts for my hair. If that Does that not feel a little frivolous? Do you not think? Like, I'm literally playing with the laws of nature so I can have better hair. Oh, actually talking about that. Oh, we'll do it tomorrow. It's fine. I was like, talking about that, I could go sell my hair dye. And then I'm like, no, I can't. Oh, quick. Because by the time I get there, I was looking at that at four o'clock in the afternoon. Oh, quick! Got one! What are you then? What are you? What kind of fish are you? We're looking for the last fishes. The last few fishes that we don't know. One of which I presume to be one of these little guys. We're missing some kind of sea urchin thing, I think. And then we're missing two bigger fishes. But every time I pull one of these up, it's a squid or a shrimp or a clam or something it's not it's never one of these rare ones i need to catch but eventually it will be if i work on it hard enough so just a thing that i will do whenever i have some spare time but i'm fairly confident i've caught all the small fish they seem to be in order on the fish list doing some fishing got a sturgeon all right then Oh, yeah. A bonito. Man, I never get new ones, do I? Okay, I'm going to fish off the bridge. And then I think I might... Maybe until 8 or 9 o'clock and then I'll go across to Coven. Because if I go to Coven too early, I end up like having nothing to do, so... fishy get into my nets or oh, onto yes. my hook please be a rare one that I haven't caught yet snapper mm -hmm. those are tiny ones there's a bigger fish there though let's give that a go whatever this is and then we'll head over to the coven and I'll keep going there's two places now there's the mountainous no not the mountain area sorry the river area around my house and by my barn and then there's this area down here so so river and ocean everywhere else I've caught all the fish 
that is possible to catch. So let's have a... Right, we haven't had a chat in a while with everybody you while they're at You would think I wouldn't appreciate tree. It's so lovely. I say that and then they give me repeats. Okay. Lena? I sprinkled some cinnamon Ooh. on our doorstep for a nice abundance attraction spell. And the kids were quick to trail it through the house. On the bright side, the carpet smells like snickerdoodles. I don't know if that's a bright side. I'm not sure I'd want my carpet smelling of cinnamon. If you keep your crystal ball near any windows, remember not to leave it. What? What? No. Okay, so we're having the fire safety talk with, <laughs> with Shelby. I kind of want to have Violet use my oh, last design on some pieces. You can't tell me a coven motif tea wouldn't be mad cool. It would be. While also kind of defeating the purpose of the whole secret identity tradition. Yeah, like Francis said, not as uh, surreptitious as you think you are. Oh, right. Well, maybe embroidered on some socks or something. Mm-hmm. And then when people ask you is what, me, what or the pattern is, is it like, hard not to take everyone's statements on the weather personally? It's like I've heard that one before as well. Did Gloria say anything? Oh yeah, she did. I think we talked to Gloria, didn't we? Yeah. Francis, what you got to say? Anything? I'm looking forward to learning magic without the stress of some looming threat or impending disaster. You know. Always good. I am not a lump of coal. I don't need that much pressure. <laughs> to turn you into a diamond, Francis. You did well, Keeper. And you can do the same when you deem it the right time to change the season again. But remember, if you change the seasons too quickly, your crops will not have a chance to grow. And imagine if you changed the season before... <sighs> imagine if you changed the season before the festival came up and stuff. It would just be a bit weird. I wonder if it would mess with it. Not that I'm going now to that finding for mom isn't that. taking up so much of my mental hard drive. Maybe I'll start expanding my herb lore studies. Yeah, sounds good. Okay, so nothing too too much to do over there then. We'll go give Wesley a present. And then tomorrow I'll just continue to work on clothing and hair as much as I can. Clothing, hair and Wesley. That's my life now. I thought I'd run out of presents. No, I've still got roast pork. I did like 10 of them. Oh my word, thank you. Hazel used to make this for me, but your version, it smells even better. And I think I'll have more ingredients for the roast beef now the carrots, I'd like you to have the this, carrots are done. You're the best, Wesley. You're keeping me running around as fast as possible. <sighs> Saving me having to make the speed boost longer spells. It's very nice. So we've got, we've done like four dates now and I think we have two to do. So we did the picnic, the beach, the diner and the bar. We've got two more to do. Is it time for bed? Yes, it is. It is time for bed. Good morning, world. Okay, so I think this morning there's mulberries ready, so let's grab those. They're important. That's how I get my silk. I've got three of three of the mulberry trees at the moment. I'm wondering whether to get rid of some of the other ones, uh, like orange and things like that, because I particularly... Well, I think orange we might be able to make... Might be able to make orange dye out of. I'm not sure, actually. I think you have to make it out of red... And yellow dyes, so you have to make it out of things like lemons and bananas. So I might find that actually lemon trees are better for me. But yeah, let's have a quick look at the sewing machine. If I had a bit of red leather, I could make that one. I can straight up make that one. And that one. That's just two pieces of red cloth. Wow, that's good. That's one piece of blue cloth. Okay, well, I'm going to make the one that I can make, I guess, and sell it to Violet. 
And see if I can make something else as well. Uh, where was it? There was a thing that I could just make. Oh, of course. We did want to make the ladybug romper, didn't we? I had been specifically looking to make that. But then I can sell what I've got now. So that's all right. So anything else I can now make? Uh, I need black cloth and I can make those leggings. Things that I can make out of just two things are ideal. Purple cloth and black leather. I really do need to make some more leather. Do I have tanning solution right now? I do, so... A bit of mushroom leather. And I'll buy any that I get from uh, uh, Kai as well. I'll do a little bit of black cloth, a couple of them. Maybe some red cloth as well. And we'll just see where we go from there. Okay, and then I want to go and... Oh, let's check opening hours for Yuri. E for Yuri. Uh, Monday and Tuesday, Saturday and Sunday. So today will be the last day for a couple of days that I can go. Definitely worth popping down there then. Mm, but maybe put some more conditioner on as well. I can just get more conditioner over the next couple of days. And sort of save up for some hair dye. It's going to take a little while, I think, to unlock all these hairstyles. Because it's going to be a bit more a bit more difficult than just clothes, isn't it? So we can go see... Is Violet open on Tuesday? I think she's open. I think she's closed Sunday, Monday, isn't she? I think she's open on Tuesday. Yeah. There we go. Uh, so we'll sell some clothes. Oh, hang on. Before we do that, I want to change into my cool romper. Look, it's so cute. It's like the cutest thing you've ever seen in your life. Okay. <laughs> this is my summer wear. So I'm going to sell my pink field overall den denims. And that has, wow, unlocked like six new designs. Perfect. I do not want to sell my cosmic carmine long because that is my maid of honor dress so i just unlocked six new things oh they are cute as a button they are cute as a button shorts i love them purple galaxy leggings a rose mini lace emerald green dress oh wow so now we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven and a half. Seven times four. Twenty-eight. Twenty-nine. Thirty. Thirty dresses to go. Wow. That is amazing. So happy. So let's head down to Yuri's place. I'm not so do you know what I'm not so sure on, on this? This is so cute. But I'm really not sure on the boots and the socks that go with it. What couldn't we have had some cute sandals or something? But anyway, never mind. We've done what we can do here. I always pop into the consciousness center just in case. Right, Yuri. Last time I came down here, I forgot to give you anything uh, nice. Marty's to eat. the only person on the island that I spot in the bakery as often as me. But he's always buying the same old danishes. Maybe he really likes danishes. Whereas you really like cookies, and I know that, so let's give you one of those. Now, what you know about pralines, Miss Wow? <laughs> These look great. I'm impressed, Tara. Right then, let's have a look at things. I own everything at the moment. I own this style, enjoy it for free. So what we're gonna do is sell some of my hair colors and see whether we have enough to unlock 
In fact, let's just in case sell various different colors. Um, sell the blonde one. There we are, three new hairstyles available. There's a cute one with flowers in. Copper twin braids. Oh, that's adorable. And I can do, oh no, I need a moonflower for that. Oh, sad times. I need pomade for that one. Auburn ponytail. Oh, I could totally have that. <gasps> oh, that's so cute. That is so cute. Uh, what else did we get? Um, it was the bun and the copper braids. I can't believe I'm one moonflower short on copper braids, but that is fine. I can't get more moonflowers until tonight, which means that I won't then be able to go and get that hairstyle for a little while. Um, but I can sell any remaining hair colours I have. So we're going to need to bring some orange hair colour and some red for the bun. I don't really particularly like the high buns anyway. Uh, I don't feel they frame Tara's face very well. But it looks like these ones... I'm trying to work them out. I don't know what those ones are. Oh no, those ones look like the, the classic wild cut in different colours. Those are the braids in different colours. Those are the buns in different colours. Those are the side sweeps in different colours. Those are the ponytails in different colours. And those ones... There's one set that I can't tell. Which is these ones. I don't know what those ones are. So at the moment I'm just getting different colours of the same cut. Where's all the space buns? Have I got all of the space buns? Oh no, there's three space buns left. And those, I'm not sure. Oh well, guess I'll find out. I like that one though. Should we go and talk to... I can put a whole bouquet down as well. I think crocuses. We're going to do crocuses today. Zephyr says she hasn't found anything unusual about the wellspring, but it's also the only thing we know caused the whole skateboard issue. Mm. I wish I could ask you for advice. Loving the cute ponytail. I do think Tara looks better with auburn hair in general. I mean, the copper hair is fairly nice too. I don't think she looks quite quite there as a blonde. I mean, yeah, maybe. I don't know. Black hair on her, I think, is just too, way too severe. But maybe with a different style, it might not be so bad. Um, the copper styles... They're kind of okay, but I really... I think I'm so used to seeing her with Auburn. It's up and down. Classic wild. Wild ponytail. It's one of the ones I've liked the most so far, but I'm thinking the, the twin braids in Auburn would be amazing to have. What am I doing right now? Have I... No, I haven't. Well, I need to pick moonflowers later anyway. Why don't we go and fish down by the beach? Then we'll pick moonflowers and water my flowers in the gloaming. I will grab any leather off of Kai. That I can. No, I've clearly had too many. That's okay. Don't worry about it, Kai. Just looking for those remaining little fishies, aren't I? While we wait for the anemones to grow. 
this is a good time to try and find them when there's just like there's a little gap in my schedule you know go to see, see if you can find recipes see if you can find the fish no not them that'll do shall I go for a cricket See what you are. A muscle, okay. Not ideal. There's fish down there looks possibly promising. I'm gonna try and catch that with a cricket as well. I don't know whether chub is just the best bait or whether different things yield different results. So we're just going to... We're just going to try different baits out as we go. And I'm trying not to accidentally catch the small fish. Oh, quick! There you go. I have a Dorado. Oh, that was one I had already. Eventually I'll get a new one, but it's going to take some time probably because, like I say, I'm down to the last three. And then up in the river I'm down to the last two, so it's, it's not going to be a quick thing. I had to go to the mines several times and I was looking mostly for recipes at that point, so I wasn't even noticing that I was catching different things. But I've done a lot of fishing actions now, which have not resulted in any kind of recipe. Oh, quick! Which is making me think it probably isn't going to be oh, got one. happening for me anytime soon. However, I am still kind of keeping my options open. with going up to the mountain and things. I'm just trying to... No, that's a tiny fish on there. Nope, nope, nope. Oh, oh yeah. It's a squid again. Oh, man, I should have just caught the fish, shouldn't I? It's nice though, because I tend to ju just do a few fishing actions, oh, yeah. then we run off and do something else, and then I run off and do something else. A flounder. So we've got various different types of fish. Do I try one more? One more. The amount of times I've tried one more, and it's been a good thing. My little fishy friends. Oh, quick! Not that fishy friend, please. Oh, no, it was a squid. Okay, I think I think it's time to admit defeat. We're gonna head across to where the moonflowers live. I'll grab those so I can have a pretty braided hairstyle. And then we'll just go and we'll make we'll make more hair dyes, sell them to Yuri. Uh, I'm gonna need to make some more food for Yuri as well. And there we are. To the gloaming, and let's have a look at these flowers. I think they will be ready tomorrow. But yeah, I'm not having a lot of luck with. Uh, Finding new fish, am I? Yeah, 
So we'll have 10 of those tomorrow. Uh, then I'll be plenty for my bumper harvest potions. And then we'll make a herd spell. And then we can use that on Marty's flock. And it'll be amazing. And I'll probably boost the potions along a bit as well. So let, on that note, let's go. I talked to the coven. Ever talked to everybody yesterday. So I don't think I need to particularly again at the moment. I'm getting a lot of repeat dialogue now. I will give Wesley a present. And listen to his repeat dialogue as well. <laughs> no, we won't listen to it. Oh, my word. Thank you. Oh, my word. The thank you. Isn't great it? for staying in with a good book. The only exception is if you're not there too. Which is most of the time, honestly. Boop. Love a good boop. Right, so these are ready. So making instant brew powder. Oh yes, wool weed. Okay, I need to remember that tomorrow. Or even tonight, actually. Make myself a bit of... Well, I kind of need some orange hair dye, but how about... We just make a couple of red hair dye for now to sell on. I just want to start unlocking hairstyles. I really like the hairstyle I have. It's a nice one. Um, Trying to remember if there's anything else I was trying to do. Done that, done that. We're looking at that. I'll get wool weed tomorrow. Because tomorrow I literally have nothing else to do. Am I ready for bed? Yeah. And I think we might actually hit the festival. Oh, the carrots are ready as well. So I can make some roast beef for Wesley. That'll be quite nice. That'll be another thing for me to do today. So let's go and... Grab the wool weed and the anemones first. And then I'll head up the mountain. I'll do a bit of digging, see if we, we, if we catch anything. Like I say, with six recipes left to go, I've got a strong suspicion that there'll be at least three per season that I'll learn. There might be one that I'll learn at the end of the summer for a quest. And then we've got fall and winter still to go. So the likelihood of me finding extra recipes there is quite high. And considering how few left there are... Hmm. So let's go and find the wool weed first. And then I'll go in and harvest my end enemies. I have harvested quite a lot of this stuff, but it's uh, it becomes a bit difficult when you're pressing flowers and things like that and it sort of uses them all up. And also it uses them up just to make like tanning solution. So if you're not really careful, <laughs> you'll have none left. They're ready today. Fantastic. And let's get out of the gloaming because you can't broom from the gloaming. You can broom from your basement and inside people's shops and all sorts of stuff. Although I, I, I feel it's, I feel like it's safer to broom from outside, you know. Right, so let's head back with the wool weed and make a, some instant brew potions. While you, if you're waiting to grow flowers, get the stuff together for instant brew potions and then you can just be a bit quicker. Like me. So I need to make bump harvest potions times three. And then we're going to go to my bench and we're going to make instant brew powder times three. We're going to instantly brew these. Because I am impatient. I feel like these are an important thing to instantly brew. Like other things I can, I can just wait. Stuff like, you know, finding out what people like. Hmm. Oh, I think I see something. Avocado. Sweet potato and coriander pizza. He really likes sweet potatoes, that boy. Hmm. Oh, I think I see something. Cleocatra likes tuna. 
It's um Okay, so we'll need to do some more crystal ball potion. I actually will just put a bit more on, I think. Like just t is I feel like I'm dotting the dotting the I's and crossing the T's there a little bit, but Moo cow, moo cow incantation. Now, does that need to go back to Lena or do I need to directly cast it on the cows? Take it to the high priestess. Right, so we need to do that tonight. And then three days to the summer festival. Oh, do I want to make anything here? Let's make some more essence of joy and copper concentrate. Then let's harvest the carrots so we can make some beef for Wesley. And also harvest the honey. And then I could maybe go get some more cotton from Thomas. We could make some more clothing. But I'm probably just going to plant any seeds I've got. I will just plant them in. Not like horrendously far behind. Oh yeah, I've still I've got some cotton already. Let's put those in. Plant you can water them for me. And I've got four sugar cane seeds. Probably gonna be a bit random in here for a bit, but you know. It's fine. I don't know what those are. Oh, they're my grapes. Okay. My spinach is uh, three days remaining. There's one thing I do love in this game. It's easy to tell what something is, even if it's just growing. Some games, if you've got like something just sprouting, it's really hard to tell the difference. Uh... Let me do some hops. Make some beer or something. Not that I really bother with that too much, but you know, maybe one day I'll need it. But I don't know. What should we put in here then? That one random corn. Let's do that. I'll just get through all of the seeds I have and then we'll get some new seeds from Lena eventually. Everything else is very nicely arranged, but uh Anything else that I want to do right now at all? Maybe we could go and see Perry. And buy all her flowers. She's done a good restock there. Levitation potion. The less I have to make, the better. No magic potions today, though. That's sad times. Scrying potions. Eventually, I will want to stalk Gloria around. <laughs> I've seen her in several different places, though. I've seen her in the woods. Uh, standing by the tree. I've seen her in her office. I've seen her by her house. I've seen her... <laughs> Sitting on a bench, sitting on a bench next to Violet, like several places, and uh, no bueno, which isn't starting to make me think it's not going to happen this season, maybe. Which would be okay with me because she's, she's literally. She's only moved in recently, so I think kind of being able to progress a relationship with her really quickly would leave you with not a lot to do, so. Okay, I don't know where I'm going to find Yuri. And also, I think we've run out of things that we can make. So I was making Italian sausage. I made a couple of them. Um, that was so I could make jambalaya, I think. I don't know where that is. Because I never know where anything is in this game. J, G, J, J, M. There we are. 
I only have one shrimp. But it's better than nothing. I think I picked up a couple of almonds. So, or almonds as I would normally say. I don't know why I suddenly call them almonds. I think we can make a couple of cookies. That Texas brownie looks amazing. It looks like it's such dark chocolate in it. Num, num, num. So, my next job is to go find Yuri and get a present. We could give Wesley a present too. Oh my word, thank you. Welcome. My brother Lou sent me our mother's signet ring. I hope he meant it to be a peace offering. I see it as a good sign he at least acknowledges my existence. Yeah. To be fair though, these do look like good, it does look like good work wear this. You do need some sturdy boots. If you're going to be a farmer. Alright, let's head up the mountain, do a bit of digging, see if we get a lucky strike on anything or whether I have genuinely gotten everything. Because I thought I'd gotten everything and then I found another recipe, you know, so it's, it's worth a try. And then we'll work on some clothing, we'll go down to the coven and I'll give the cow thing into Lena. Oh no. No! I've got to pick up all the rubbish, it's so annoying. So it's been a two or three days now without any recipes showing up. I'm not entirely sure how long to try for before giving up and saying, hey, the last six recipes are definitely going to be found through questing. But I've done a lot of fishing and a lot of digging and not found anything at all so i've got a feeling the last six are gonna be especially this one that looks like a toffee apple and it's gonna be like a halloween thing no doubt uh i'm going to actually just fish up here until about seven o'clock okay that doesn't look good let's try up here Hmm. The fishing up here looks absolutely dire. But maybe if I get rid of the tiny fish, we'll pick up some bigger ones. Oh, I'm always going to coven way too early. I get there really fast, so I don't want to be like... Stood there, nothing to do. Like a lemon. To smelt. I'm sure there's a pun there somewhere. That's not going to get me anything. You know, just let's just cut our losses. <laughs> go, Tara, go. Right, so we should now have our wonderful herd incantation. I have the incantation for the animal blessing ritual, High Priestess. Hold on to it. This incantation is more potent when performed in full sun. Let's all meet at Marty's farm tomorrow during the day. Great. Right. Can totes do that then? So we've got to wait till tomorrow. Done that. Done that. Marty's farm tomorrow. Done that. Wellspring. I'll do that after the festival. I'm my magic is running lower and lower, but uh, I've still got half of it left, so I feel like it's kind of okay at the moment. 
Uh, we could have a chat with everybody. And see I'm what looking up forward to. to learning magic. I am not a. No, that's a repeat. Do I have a repeat for you? You know, Keeper, sometimes I feel like I'm the only one remembering to use our coven titles. You probably are. I'm the first to admit that everyone's name just flows a little easier. Le Hi, Priestess. Oh, clearly. <laughs> Do you ever just look up and soak in the moon's rays? Sometimes. Sometimes I find doing so more soothing than even fresh sunlight. Sometimes I visit. Why do because I won't stand. Ariel swears by the feeling of earth under your bare feet, but I'm like, nah, I'm good. Shoes I can are feel good. the gravel, twigs, and stones just fine through my shoes. Thanks. <laughs> Don't listen to Ariel, his feet are weird anyway. Hey Tara, is it weird that I can already guess what magic duties Juliet would be really good at? Hmm. Not that she want to balance the wellspring all day or whatever. She probably end up being like initiate tune master. <laughs> okay, I'll have a chat to Violet and Mira because I don't speak as to them as often. As communing with nature is sometimes it's just you know we done we done that convo the gate being fixed has been such a relief thank you again tara it's my pleasure it was about time okay time to go home and sort out marty's cow tomorrow and then do the festival i think yeah i'll just oh what's going on here then have you run out of bait? But she needs bait. I need to go see Bruno quite desperately then. How many chub have I got? I have 20 of those as well. They are fishy. And then Miney's back as well. Miney will probably just need a new gemstone, so we'll just clear out your stuff. Give you a new diamond. There you go. It's 10 o'clock, so let's have a look in my shed. See what's going down in here. And see if there's anything I can make to sell to Violet. We are now down to the last 30. I've worked really hard on that and I'm really proud of myself. <laughs> so blue cloth, and we can make a few of those. Anything I can make straight off the bat. And then I'm gonna start making things based on what I actually, see that one, red cloth. Just red cloth, that's it. Black leather. Black leather seems to be required for quite a lot of things. So why don't we just dye a whole load of leather black? I could make that. Make two of those, actually. And one of those. And then dye some leather black. And maybe make a couple of red cloths or something. Cool. And then tomorrow we can go sell those to Violet and see if we can unlock a few more clothing options. Is it time for bed? I think by the end of summer, beginning of autumn, I'll have all the clothes unlocked and we'll just be working on hairstyles. Should be pretty nice, I think. I feel like the, the end of the game isn't too far away either, and I'll be a bit sad about that. Hey, Marty. Hi, uh, Tara. There's a bunch of folks in cloaks and masks at my ranch. Does that mean the animal blessing is ready? Yep. Yes. Let's head over to your place. Sure. You take the lead. Are you ready to begin the animal blessing rite? Yes, let's begin. 
As the sun rises from the east, we cast this charm on friendly beasts. Should they fall ill, or should they roam, may they be well and come back home. Aww, that's a cute ritual. They look happy. Wow, that was incredible. You liked that, didn't you, Mutilda? Oh, he's working on that baby voice I taught him. I can't thank <laughs> all of you enough. This was well done, Keeper. This rite can only be performed in summer with a full coven. But if you wish to bless your flock on your own, try this. A minor animal blessing recipe. Oh, that is adorable. Penny and Finn. What's wrong, Shelby? Oh. He looks really troubled. That is not good. Nothing. Just, we performed a rite in town. In full daylight. Never thought I would see that in my lifetime. Huh. Maybe Hazel was right all along. Wish she could have seen it. Give the ritual some time to work its magic. Minor animal blessing can now be crafted at your writing desk. So if we have a quick look in here now. I'm missing two powders that I could potentially need. A few potions, like four potions, five potions. One, two incantations. Midsummer animal blessing. Where's the minor animal blessing then? I did just learn it. We are very, very close to having like everything unlocked. And like I say, it's kind of sad. But I think there's going to be like a, an update for year three. I, I'm pretty sure they're saying there might be a third year's worth of stuff. That would be amazing and make this such a cool game at that point. Like there's already so much to do in it. And like everything has felt fun. Everything has felt action packed all the time as well. Which isn't always the case. A lot of these games can like add artificial grind. Which I am becoming less and less tolerant of. I'm very much more about let's do the fun bits of all these games. Yuri, I've got something for you. It's a different kind of present. I'm waiting on Parker to hook me up with a cut of aloe to propagate. I don't know mm. why I didn't bring plants of my own. Knowing doggone well, I collect fingertip burns like they're going out of style. Yeah, well, hairdressers are always cutting their fingers. It is a well-known thing. And I have this for you. Never thought I'd get a good jambalaya in Fairhaven unless I made it myself. Did you devein the shrimp? I did. That's my girl. Thanks, Tara. Okay, so we're ready to... Probably first one will be in her shop. I don't know, we could follow her into Angus's just in case. <laughs> it's her day off, you see. Right, so we've done the the cow ritual, which is was the last thing I needed to do. Other than the wellspring, which obviously I want to do after the summer festival. And that's going to start in two more days. Uh, will the hairdressers be open tomorrow? Let's see. Wednesday, Thursday, Friday closed. So no, it'll only be open on Saturday. Which I think might be the festival. The festival will either be Saturday or Sunday. I'm not sure. It doesn't matter though. I've done everything I need to do as far as I can tell. So let's just get on with this and sell some things to Violet. Three new designs available. So 
see what they are. So we got the Celestial Gold Jacket, the Rough and Tawny Jacket, and uh, an All Natural. Oh, nat oh, All Natural overalls. <laughs> I see. I'll buy all of those. Because I can. It's not free, but I can. I just can. So now we're down to 8, 16. 24, 5, 6, 27. 27 designs left. That's really good. I'm very, very excited by this. It, we've got so many awesome designs that I can use. Um, so Yuri's not open at the moment. That is fine. She likes the bakery a lot. <laughs> So my job today then will probably be to go fishing. Oh, that's a point. Bruno, are you open today? Bruno, Bruno, Bruno. Because my bait is really low. Yes, on a Thursday, we'll be open in half an hour's time. Just enough time for me to run over there. I'm looking forward to having all of the clothing options unlocked because then I won't feel like I need to sell everything to Violet all the time. That's going to make things a lot nicer for me. Right. Hi. Meester. I should like to sell you lots of stuff. Probably be quicker if I just sell the things I have a lot of. Like all these things that I've got like one of or something. Bit annoying. So maybe I'll just keep hold of those to sell the ones that are in like several digits. Okay, so I would like to buy from you about 500 chub. And then I might need to go and... Uh, have a chat with like Francis and Zephyr about diamonds and pearls and things like that. So, I could easily make a lot more money by selling more things, I just don't need it, so there's no point, in my opinion. Do 500 worms as well, I may as well. And then Fishy can just go off for two weeks, do his own thing, you know. Enjoy life. Enjoy the fishing lifestyle. Right then. Let me just check. No one else has got any weird things above their heads or anything like that before this... Before this spring... No, sorry. Summer festival comes along. And I have to have a real think about. And I'm going to just think through who's going to be the summertide star. Does it have to be a female? Okay, assuming it does, we've got a mirror. She would be great. Yuri, I don't know very well. I'm not sure on that one. Give her, I feel, doesn't feel the magic of the situation. <laughs> Juliet's a good one, I think. Maybe Gloria, but I think Gloria might have done it before. Whereas Juliet's a, a rising star, you know? It would mean a lot to her, I think. Lena. Could do. But again, I, I feel like Gloria and Lena are so like high up and they, they've got like lots of prestige and power and things. It's, I feel like maybe Amira or Juliet so far. Obviously, Sophia possibly, but again, like I say, she's going to be getting married soon, so she'll be like the star of the show there. Or Violet. So I think Amira, Violet, or Juliet would probably be my my would probably be my uh three candidates let's put it that way it's 
So yeah, let's work on more hair stuff and more clothes stuff. And then go do some fishing. Hair, clothes and fishing are my three things at the moment that I work on in between everything else. I could make another signature wild jacket. I could make... There was something that just required red. Oh, where was it? It was like a casual hoodie jacket thing. This one. And a spare. Oh no. Don't have enough red cloth for that now. Make that one. Make several of those actually. Let's do it. Let's make several cafe latte midi dresses and take them over to Violet again and see how many things I can unlock using that. And then we'll be back to the drawing board for a bit. Right then. Three new designs ready. Six new designs ready, including the Plum Shimmer Romper. <gasps> That's amazing. How many are we missing now? So, eight, 16, 21. We are down to the last 21, guys. Three new designs available. Okay. Wow, some really nice, really nice looking dresses here. <gasps> that is everything. It's like Doctor Who's new costume. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, nine. Nine left. Six left. Oh, ho, ho. I want to go make more stuff. I think I'm going to have to wait, though. Unless... Okay, this is what I'm going to do. This is what I'm going to do to see if we can just swing a couple more designs. Okay, is I'm going to wear my Cosmic Carmen. I'm going to sell my romper. Yay! Oh, it's so close as well. I've sold just like I've sold everything now. <laughs> but there are more than six designs that I can't sell. I've got all of these, but the, look, there are oh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve designs. So there are some secret ones to unlock. I am so happy there's someone in town that can do my hair. I've been so busy with the boutique, I've been neglecting my crown. And that, my beautiful Violet, is a travesty. I'm right there with you. <laughs> Sometimes washing my hair gets moved to tomorrow. I hear you. I know just what they say about tomorrow. Never comes. Hey. Three more designs, and it's so close. I just need to make one thing. Is there anything I could make quickly and get tomorrow? And then we'll work on hair after that, obviously. But then I feel like at that point, I can, I can make 
thing, cute things to wear and not worry. You know, at the moment I'm worried all the time. Like, oh, I've got to sell this thing. La la la. What what can I make for the least materials and sell to Violet and la la. la. But then it'll be like, what do I want to wear? And I'll be like, oh, I'll have a red one and a black one and a blue one. And one for every day of the week. And the gloaming one. The gloaming one's so cute. And that purple one's so cute. And... I'm not so sure I like the, the jeans and t-shirts ones. Uh, nah. These shorts and t-shirts, though, they're really cute. And then, um, like, I definitely think, like, a one of these. I'm not sure which one, though. Maybe this purple one, the vine one. That looks really nice. Uh, just for, like, casual stuff. And then I could have a, cute, a few cute mini dresses. I could basically make one of everything if I wanted to. And just be like, what does, what does Tara want to wear today? Oh, yeah, this one and this one and this one. So that's probably what I would do, just get a few different designs and just be like, I'll make the ones I think cute, are cutest first and then just go from there, really. Um, right, but anyway. <laughs> Anything that I can make with not too much effort. So a piece of purple cloth. One piece of black cloth. If there's anything. It's got leather in it. Well, I've got some black leather, so maybe some red cloth and some black cloth. I apparently have no cloth, so uh, that would be a good start. Two pieces of cloth at least, please. Some black cloth, so we make some red cloth. We make some more red cloth, I think. And we'll go from there. And I'm. Yeah, I am going to go to the mountain and dig up stuff. <laughs> I'm an absolute terror. I'm, I'm awful. In my maid of honor dress, basically. Again, not expecting anything to come out of this, but I will get the Nigella while I'm at it. If she's suddenly like, oh, look, a recipe, I'll, I will probably eat my hat. I feel like it's done at this point, to be honest. Um, but one thing I would like to do is a bit more fishing as well. So me and Fishy can stand next to each other. Fishy, I thought you had run out of bait. Oh yeah, I gave you some more, didn't I? But not a big top up. We're going to give you a big top up in a minute. Got one. I bet they had a whale of a time designing all of these outfits and hairstyles. They are so cool though. I just really enjoy just having fun. Uh, having fun with hairstyles and clothes. I'm only going to need like 20, 30 of each. So Fishy can have 500 of each. Just keep on trucking. There you go. Keep going. Fishy, enjoy. Oh, quick! Now, if there's a big fish in the pond, I want to try and get the big fish. Eventually, oh, wow. it'll be one of the ones I, I need. But not today. There must be like a couple of super rare ones or something, I'm guessing. I think the festival is going to be next time. 
I'm looking at the time and I'm thinking I might have one more day in this episode and that'll be it. But that's okay. That's fine. Now then, do I need to go to Coven for anything? I don't really think I need to. Um, do I want to just in case? Maybe. Because looking at my quests, there's we've done everything other than giving the cow ritual time. So I feel like... Maybe I just quickly pop over there, see what's going down, see what's going on. And then come back? I don't know. So we've got a couple of essences of joy and a few of these dudes and let's see about making some conditioner then so i don't know how i'm doing for wildflowers i tend to be always quite low on them at the moment i'm much better at coconut oil than i am at the wildflowers to be honest i mean i do have like some nigella for example I actually ended up with quite a bit of that because of various things. Mm. That's another thing that I'm trying to work on. Collect it's kind of a bit of a collector's thing at the moment. Working on collections while we finish the story off. So I'm just finding out mm. everybody's favourites. I think I see something. Salmon and tuna. That's not really that surprising. Let's work on Emmy. Mm. I think I see something. Fish fingers. And Emmy again. Hmm. Oh, I think I see something. Chocolate cupcake. That doesn't surprise me at all either. And then, oh, Damon. Let me start on Damon. Hmm. Oh, I think I see something. So we've got three more things to find for Damon. It's um... I will put on some more crystal ball potions. And we can also buy some from... also buy some from uh, Perry if we want to every so often. So that's not too bad. So just making a whole load of um, conditioners for hair dye. Uh, I will nip across the coven as well. But yeah, I can't believe how well we did with the recipes today because we went from having something like 30 to get to now having three to get. We'll have them finished next time, I think. Which is absolutely amazing. You know, Keeper, sometimes the first... You know what? No one's saying anything new here anymore, so I, I, I feel like I'm going to just head straight to the beach and see what I can catch. For an hour or two. But yeah, I just don't seem to be having a, a good time with catching anything new right now. It just still seems to be old stuff. There's like two fishes I need. I can't see. Oh, quick! Gotcha. Yeah, two different fish, and then there's one crawly thing. Down here, and there's two fish up on the mountain, and I just am not ever getting a new fish. I fished and fished and fished and fished and fished, and, fished and I'm not finding anything new for ages. I have fished at different times of day. I have fished. Um, okay, it's hard being Dr. Shoots, okay? Oh, come on. What are you going to be? Sturgeon. <laughs> it's impossible. Have all the fishing spots gone now? No, there's a couple there, okay. Try with the cricket for a while. I think it might just be that these things are just genuinely oh, yeah. rare. Ooh! 
the very last one. Right, so now it is just two fish down here and two fish up there. Well, at least I did got something. I've been fishing and fishing and fishing this whole episode. I really, really feel that I'm done on the recipes now. Like, I really feel that way. I, I think that's... I think I'm right on that. We're really very close Time to being done. Oh. Did you have a present yet, Mr. Wesley? And eventually we'll be at a point where we have given Wesley enough presents to get the sixth date. And we've unlocked all the hairstyles. Once oh, I got into that. Thank you. Hazel used to make this for me, but your version? It smells even better. Then I feel like we've gotten... Somehow this hair really highlights the green of your eyes. It's lovely, Tara. Aww. It is a nice one, isn't it, Wesley? Okay, bad time. Am I ready for bed? Ah. So I think we're about one and a half hearts away from finishing all of the Wesley content. Quote unquote. Okay, so um, let's see if I can put some more leather on. I can. We've got a couple of tanning solutions going, and then some fish leather will do. Apparently, we're making that out of squid. I don't really mind too much what we make it out of. And I think it's just going to be a case of getting like one more thing going. I think that one and this one. Once I've sold those, I'm pretty sure that's going to be it for all of Violet's uh, various costumes. So that's going to be really, really nice. <laughs> Actually, that looks surprisingly cute. She's going for her morning jog, although the jog is very slow right now because we need to do a speed spell. They're not lasting as long because I keep the using the ones that Wesley gives passed. me. Lighten my feet and make me fast. I'm not making the long ones anymore. I'm just like, do I have one from Wesley? Yeah, thank you, Wesley. Love you. Bye. So we'll just get to the end of today. And then we'll be all good. be time for the uh, beautiful um yeah we'll just get through today and then it will be time to end the episode and then next time we'll come in straight away on the summer festival right at the beginning of the episode which might be quite nice oh it's 8 50 so it's time to <laughs> i love this outfit actually i didn't they don't look as nice as they do look as they look on they look really nice on the, the joggers and hoodies. I didn't think they would look this good. Alright, Violet. Let's see if we can get these last three. So, I'm gonna... Again, I will just be putting on this pretty... It is really gorgeous, actually. But it's, I just don't feel it's wedding-y. As, as much as maybe some other things might be. Right. I'm going to sell, I like that one, so I might keep it if I can get away with it. Yeah, which I can. Pensive blue shorts, banana split overalls, and vanilla chai leggings. So looking at this, we still have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. There's still 12 things. Oh, there must have been some things hiding down here. But there are 12 designs that must need to be picked up as part of quest lines or possibly a patch or something like that. Because they are now not available at Violet's shop. Have you noticed anything off about Sebastian lately? I keep running into him in the strangest places around town. 
No. Sebastian's been so busy with school and the whole being a witch thing. Call me mushy, but I'm just hanging out with my little bro. It is mushy, but it's cute. You got any leather today, Kai? You got loads, actually. Wonderful. We can make. I can finally make things for myself. Just be like, that is cute. I want that. That is what I will make for myself and I will keep it forever. I, d I don't sell things for money at this point. I sell things for shop unlocks. Um, so now my main two things I want to do are to get the last four fish. I am almost certain that the recipes remaining Okay, one last go up the mountain, and if I don't find anything this time, I'm gonna say that we're done. Oh uh, yeah, and I want to I want to get this dress laundered ready for the wedding. I, I you know I I, I I did promise Violet I wouldn't do any work in it, but I really wanted to get the unlocks. So I broke my promise. <laughs> so I better just like quickly cover that up. <laughs> So yeah, um, this will now be what the third or fourth day without a recipe coming out of the dirt. So, oh, do you like the onsen? That's pretty cool. I think I have a cookie for you. Oh no, not right Ipa now. Ipa has such fantastic herbal tea mixes. I can see how working up here would be the perfect environment for trying a new one every day too. I feel like we need to wait until your shop is open tomorrow but it's, is it now one day until the festival because if that's the case then it's going to be tomorrow isn't it yeah it starts in one more day so I want a cute summer dress for the summer festival this is cute but it's not like cute cute And then we'll, we'll work on hair for the rest of the summer. Um, let's have a look. The honey jacket. We could do that. Could probably get a gloaming jacket ready. Although that was kind of my my one for doing the end quest and everything. So, What's like... These are just normal ones. These are really cute. The, the mini dresses. Hmm. Those will work ones. Formal. I don't think we want to be formal. I think we either want like a little cute mini dress. Maybe a cute shorts and t-shirt or a signature wild sort of looking one. I like the honey the honey one actually. And I like the pressed flower one as well. Maybe we'll do pressed flower. How about red silk and red leather? That shouldn't be too hard to do. And then I want to make myself a cute work outfit. And I feel like maybe a short t-shirt might be quite nice. Minted on demand. Uh, so green cloth, yellow silk thread. Hmm, okay. Let's do a yellow silk thread. And then go and get some green dye because I'm almost certain I won't have that. So I've just got a couple of options, you know. I like having options. I can find out a few more things that people like, even though I don't need them anymore. Like I say, it's more a collection completion thing than anything else. I'm making lots of conditioner, which will mean I can make a lot of different hair dyes, especially red, because it's made out of basically clay, which is very easy for me to make. I'll do a concentrated levitation as well, just so I've got plenty of... Uh, 
plenty of things to help me move around the place. Then we're out of essence of copper and out of paper. Right, let's go make some paper upstairs. Oh, I didn't make the green dye. Darn. I am assuming I don't have green. No, I don't have green. Down we go <laughs> again. Green dye. So the one thing I came down here for and I was like, oh, I've got a basement full of stuff. then so green cloth so by tomorrow we're gonna have lots of nice things so that's going to take six hours that's going to take four hours so by eight o'clock tonight i should be able to make two new beautiful wonderful dresses in the meantime let's go see perry and just like raid her entire store again as usual because what i'm trying to do is always have enough wildflowers available for a the things i'm going to need to do but b for all the conditioner i'm going to have to make okay so much conditioner and perry has so many so many nice things You know, she's got like two crystal ball potions as well. I don't really need your pine cones though. I mean, half the herbs I buy, I probably don't need. What have you got to say about the things? The wellspring's always been unpredictable, but especially now, so much change has happened in such a short period of time. Mm. Indeed, indeed. I'm looking forward to having more like, um, seasonally appropriate wear as well like clothing it definitely gives me a bit of a break from all the fishing uh so anything else i wanted to do i'm just trying to think i'll go and see if the ritual has worked with marty let's go definitely want to check that out How are they all doing? Marty, Marty? Huh? Oh. Marty is gonna be shut Thursday to Saturday. Right, probably down the beach or something. We can always like chat to him though. Oh, there's another storm coming. Good grief. That does mean a lot of coconuts might wash up on the beach. So Marty sometimes stands down here. Sometimes goes to the bar. Oh, there he is. Let's have a chat about your, about your livestock. Let's, let's listen. Tara, I've got something for you. I've never seen my animals so happy. When I first came here, I had no idea what I was doing. And now... You still don't? Yeah. But somehow, I've made it a whole year. And I know I have you to thank. So, thanks, Tara. Aw, you're welcome. I have been rewarded with 270 coins. Yuri's single, right? I've had my eye on someone else, but uh, maybe it's time to explore a different route. Sorry, seven hearts. She's going to be into me. <laughs> you might be facing some stiff competition on that one. That's basically what I said. <laughs> okay, so let's... What am I even doing? I don't even know. Oh, I think I need to end the episode, really, don't I? So we could do a little bit of fishing just before the end. Um, can we fish along here at all? No. I want to try and see if I can get those last two fish down by the beach. I don't feel like 
coven needs anything right now. Maybe I'll have more luck in a rainy, rainy storm. You never know. I'll spend a couple of hours fishing and then I will go to bed. I'll end the episode. Next time we'll come back and we will do the summer festival. By the time I get back to my house, if I go just before, I can I can make all the costumes I want. If I do enough fishing, I will eventually get the the ones I don't have. It's gonna happen. Just taking some time. Ha! Gotcha. That was a sturgeon. Bonito. I don't want to get those two. I can't be bothered with them. Alright, I think I'm going to just run back home now. I will get them eventually. It will happen. We got the, the sea urchin thing eventually. Just if every time I have a little bit of downtime, I, you know, stick to some fishing, it will happen. Still not one single... And I'm very certain at this point that I've just had all the recipes because there's not been one single recipe pop up from any of the fishing or any of the dirt patches. I remembered we were going to make some paper. Right, so I wanted to make a pressed flower jacket and dress. And I wanted to make like a short and t-shirt combination. Was it the green one I wanted? This used to be the green one I've made. Let's see what they look like on. Oh, I like that. That's so summery. I love the shoes. And I've got my jogging gear. And then I've got a really cute little... Oh, look at that. Cute little dress I can wear. I think that'll be my summer... That'll be my summer dress. For my summer... For my summer festival. Right, see... So, Wesley, one last, one last roast pork for you before we go to the festival. Oh my word, thank you. Hazel used to make this for me, but your version, it smells even better. I do wish I had the twin plats by the summer. That would have been really cool. Violet must have put a little magic into this outfit, sweetheart. You look enchanting. I'm insulted. I made that myself. <laughs> you are. But then again, I suppose I get all the patterns from Violet. But yeah, it looks lovely with the necklace as well. It's just all really nice. Am I ready for bed? So that is the end of the episode for today. Uh, you can look forward to the summer festival next time and us sort of progressing the game along a little bit and getting into the second half of the summer season and seeing what new surprises are before us at that point. And uh, we are totally ready for the wellspring and everything like that. So we need to head to the town square for the festival, which we will be doing next time. So I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, then please do leave me a like below. If you'd like to see more, please subscribe. I'll let you know when the videos are out. I hope to see you next time. In the meantime, please look after yourselves and keep being awesome.